1994, I started the Koenigsegg company. I had a dream. I wanted to build the best sports car. Little did I know how hard it would be, but I had a dream. And I was willing to sacrifice everything to make it happen. It did happen, and every effort along the way was worth it. Even a devastating fire tried to stop us. It failed. Here we are in Geneva at the motor show by ourselves. Everyone else packed up. We said that we cannot do. We built this amazing stand and we have these amazing cars and just to pack up and go home, no way. We follow the motto of the Go Squadron, the show must go on. Of course, not the Geneva Motor Show, that shut down this year. Let's hope it comes up next year again, we will see. But we want to take the opportunity here, by ourselves, to at least make you behind the screens of all the computers around the world to see what we're up to. And so we at least can get the chance to present what we prepared a whole year since last year before we got here. We have the Regera. We say 2020 is the year of the Regera. We are at the production rate of one car per week, basically churning them out, I would say, for a small factory. One car a week is not so bad. And by the end of the year, we will have built all 80 Regeras. As some of you know, last year, we broke a world record with the Regera. 31.49 seconds to 400 kilometers per hour and back to zero again. Unheard of. <clears throat> What's even more amazing, really, is that that was done on a very poor track with very low grip. So we're quite certain if we redo that in slightly better conditions, we can go under the magic 30 second numbers with a Regera. So during the year of the Regera, we will have another go and see what it can do, also around some racetracks and so on. This car is really the pinnacle of all our efforts until now, but not only do we have the Regera? Everything we learned and put into this car, we revamp and redo for our parallel models that I will show you tonight. And of course, the brother of the Regera, uh, my father, the Jesko. Last year, we showcased the track version. This year, we have promised to showcase the high speed version. So please, ladies and gentlemen, enjoy. Ladies and gentlemen, the Jesco Absolute. So what is this machine we have in front of us? <clears throat> Many of you can recognize it from last year's track focused Jesco. But this year, it's the high speed focused Jesco. This is the fastest Koenigsegg we will ever endeavor to make. We spent thousands of hours in CFD calculations and streamlining this car from a design perspective, from a cooling perspective, from a high-speed stability perspective. We ended up with a drag of only 0 0.278. It is the lowest drag number for any of these types of cars. With 1600 horsepower, with 1500 newton meters of torque, you need a lot of cooling and you need wide tires to put the power to the ground 
and you still do need downforce to make it stable. And to end up with that kind of low drag number is truly amazing. And if you do your math, and if you check our RPM limits, uh, the power graph, and the drag of this car, you will see the potential of the top speed of this car. It is truly amazing. Like last time when we took the world speed record for a series produced homologated car on a public road in two directions, we had to wait years to find the right venue and to be able to close off a road. And it was also still dangerous. There can be winds, there can be animals, there can be something rolling out on the road. It's just dangerous uh, activity to do this kind of high speed testing. But if you do it in a controlled manner, you can minimize the risks. And it would be a shame not to show what this car is capable of. When it will happen, we don't know yet. Exactly how, we don't know yet. But we've built the car to be able to set new high-speed records. That's what the Yesco Absolute is about. The name also comes from the fact, of course, that this is the absolutely fastest Koenigsegg we will ever make. Very exciting. The customers can choose in the configurator that we're opening up today on all the pre-sold Koenigseggs if they want the track version or if they want the absolute high-speed version. We don't know how many of the 125 cars will be either or, so it'll be very interesting to see what our customers choose. But we're not done yet. We have something more for you at the Geneva Koenigsegg Motor Show 2020. Stay tuned.